Hi everyone and today it is a very strange day because we're doing leadership lessons from a Yorkshire pudding and you may be thinking what am I talking about? Well recently I have gone vegan uh, oh we're nearly at two months now so uh, enjoying it a lot but the one thing that my family really 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 enjoys is a roast dinner and in particular <coughs> excuse me Yorkshire puddings not the meat the Yorkshire pudding and so I've really missed the Yorkshire puddings. And uh, so I set my team, which happened this morning because it's uh, half term to be my kids, a challenge, which was uh, instead of saying we can't have Yorkshire puddings, which is to go find a way of, uh, of making Yorkshire puddings without the egg or the milk. And um, so they've gone off and they found a recipe that apparently is going to work. So I'm really looking forward to it. And <clears throat> excuse me, the lesson that I learned today was about how to to not just stop at the end of the road when the wall is there and you're thinking this can't be done um, and to to for yourself and for your team to look at problems in a different way and over the last two months I've really discovered um, that that actually you really can look at being a non-meat eater in a different way and you can still enjoy a whole load of things uh, in in all sorts of different ways. Now don't worry I'm not going to try and convert you to veganism and I, you don't need to say uh, really anything about why I'm being vegan and all that sort of thing. That's not the point. The point is really about how do you overcome challenges in your business, in your life with your team to try to get people to look at things in a different way rather than just saying oh it's broken it can't be done i can't do it um quite often people stop when they find a problem and they don't look for a different way of doing something it's as if they've got the brick wall but it's almost like they need to turn the brick wall and look around the side or look over the top like the old chad do you remember that the old chad pictures um to look outside of this brick wall that they've come across so as much as it's probably irrelevant to your business is Yorkshire pudding unless you make Yorkshire puddings for your business um Aunt Bessie or something like that then it's all about thinking about the problem and thinking okay it's not going to stop me and our team it's not going to stop us how can we start to think differently this isn't just about little problems this is about a whole way of treating the way we show up at work this can't be done to a can be done, could be done, might be able to be done type of um, uh, way of thinking of things and actually looking for a solution that could be something completely different. So I'm going to leave you with that. Tell me what you think. What have you had to uh, change and look at differently because you were stuck? Uh, you thought it couldn't be done, but you've managed it. Tell me what you've done and what you've done with your team to help them to think in a more positive, constructive and lateral way. Let me know. Bye bye.